Hi, I'm Sean Galloway. I'd like to share with you some thoughts on a very popular workshop of ours, Developing Leadership Safety Roles, Responsibilities, and Expectations. Walk up to any leader in your organization, regardless of level, and ask them the role that they play in safety. What are they going to respond with? Ask them what they're responsible for doing to create excellence in performance and culture. What are they going to respond with? Is the response to make sure if their people are injured, they interview folks and investigate the event? Or is it purposeful things that they need to do to show their support and to truly lead that path towards excellence? In this workshop, we go through your organization and we help you define by level what are the primary roles. Like you want somebody to be a great safety communicator. That's a role. Now what do they need to be responsible for doing? That needs to be observable. Often it's behaviorally defined then. And then what do we expect that we'll experience if those responsibilities are carried out. When we start to define excellence by what people do to create the result, that's much more sustainable than if we just focus on the result. Anytime you achieve a result and you don't know precisely what performance got you there, how are you going to repeat it next year? It's a little bit of what I call management by voodoo. Knock on wood, we haven't had any accidents, everything must be going well. Have we truly defined what people's roles, responsibilities, and expectations are in safety? If not, this workshop provides you a great opportunity. Hi, I'm Terry Mathis. The workshop that Sean just described to you uh, is kind of an interesting one. I'll bet when he said roles, responsibilities, and expectations, you thought job descriptions. We've got job descriptions. We don't need all of this other things. Think about this. A job description is the responsibilities. What if, you, what if you're a, in a play and you know your lines, but you don't know what your character is? You don't know what your role is, and you don't know what you're really trying to do in this play. Are you trying to please the audience? Are you trying to please the critics? Are you trying to do both? This is the importance of all three of these. Roles, responsibilities, expectations. When you get all three of these firmly in place for every level and every job description in your organization, people are clear not only on what they need to do, what they need to be, but what they need to produce in safety. This is a great workshop. I'm looking forward to seeing you there. Or if you'd like a private workshop, please contact us and work out the details.